What kind of challenges do I face as a dino owner in Tornado Springs? <laughs> uh, honey, have you looked around here? Those hay bales on the roof aren't for insulation, you know, nor is the goat. But, being honest, it's not so much of a bother having the town turned upside down once in a while. You get used to it. The real trouble for me is when we lose power. We've got a lot of hard-working people in this town, and we don't get a lot of call for salad. The people want their burgers and their fries and their chicken wings, you know, good hearty hot food to see them through the day. When the power is out, the fryers are out, the griddle's out, and if we can't fry or griddle, we can't feed. Good coffee will enliven the mind, but it does not satisfy the stomach. The things they are changing. Now we have two windmill towers providing power to the area. Have you seen them? Tall contraptions like a water tower on a telegraph pole with all manner of fans and gizmos on top. Al keeps wanting to tell me how they generate the electricity, but I know. I tell him it's science and that's nice and that is all I need to know. Like I said to Cooper, you take care of the power and I'll take care of the people. <laughs>